Hey YouTube World, Hub City RC here. Just thought I'd give you guys a little tour of the shop. Just trying to get some content on my channel. Not sure what anyone's gonna like, but here we go. Got my little scale accessory area. We got a two-wheel drive slash with a, it's a Shelby Daytona body. Kind of hard to tell, just kind of a something different I was working with. Got the uh, Notorious 6S V5. And then we got us a four-wheel drive slash the new Bronco body on it. Uh, Hubson, not sure model, the 4K gimbal drone. Um, little El Cheapo uh, Sima that I first bought. Got me a little... I think it's a FSP FJ Cruiser, little uh, low C mini. I think it's the mini B. Little scale trailer to pull around and gotta have the yellow FJ because bam, yellow FJ, had to have it. Anyway, got our parts area here, batteries, computer, charging stations, all the goodies. And then we got the rest of my storage shelf over here we got a cfx the mst uh odds and ends i'll be going through all these individually in future videos got the trx6 rocking a bunch of scale accessories all kinds of different goodies in there little bicycles all the good stuff super heavy super impractical but was going for a trail truck instead of a dedicated crawler, so that's kind of where I'm at with that one. Um, you guys saw the axial running on the previous video, and then I got my Danchi Ridge Rock over here. Um, couldn't find an aftermarket body that I was really happy with, so I just took some vinyl, wrapped her up, done deal. Uh, let's see, we just got us uh, another body from the uh, CFX, that's the stock one, just uh, running a different one. That one's kind of top heavy. It's kind of my trail truck. We got to see Ecto with a kind of a half attempt at a digital camo something or other. Just didn't really like the solid yellow. Looked a little toyish. I got the creeper body for another one of the tent scales. My boat bag for all my whatnots. We got a bunch of spare bodies, all kinds of different stuff. You guys don't care. Uh, we got us a Vector SR80 Pro, and that one's pretty much bone stock. I've put some larger turn fins on it, sharpened the rudder, that's about it. We got a Sonic Wake, all the goodies, custom props by Offshore Electric, Das Boda. Thanks, Chris, appreciate it. Um, Sonic Wake is another wrap. Um, did by myself it's uh, carbon fiber with uh, green reflective kind of hard to see without the sunlight on it but it's a pretty neat looking rig in the light gotta say um, got the good old Zonda 41 one of my favorite rigs a couple little scale goodies I know it probably drags me down a little bit but I'm not a speed run guy yeah I like going fast but I'm not looking to set any records and sometimes I'm willing to sacrifice a little bit of uh, function for form just thought they look cool and moving on over let's see got a drift car that's a Chinese all carbon I think it's a Yokomo I believe and a bunch of tires for all kinds of my scales whatnot we got our small ones over here my daughter's little Teton Teton, however you want to say it. Got the full lineup of the uh, 24 scale axials. Wife drives the Jeep. Little girl has the uh, deadbolt. And of course, the best looking one is mine. Gotta love the Chevy C10. Uh, back over to some boats. Got another Sonic Wake. Uh, this one's my dad's that I just finished putting a wrap on for him. Um, he's an ex. Uh, Fire Chief for uh, Lubbock Fire Department, so got him some goodies on there. Kind of hard to see. Put a Lubbock Fire Department symbol on it. Some Chief Horns. Got the old man's name on it. 
He hasn't seen it yet, so the big unveil is waiting. Um, Bone Stock Electronics just added him a water pickup for some cooling. Got the Outlaw Jr. or whatever. Yeah, Outlaw Jr. Um, Bone Stock, sharpened blade, couple stickers, no big deal. Got the Mad Cat. Um, and these are both from, uh, who was that? Thunder Tiger. Really neat rigs for, I think I paid about 25 bucks a piece for them. Um, and they're great for what they are. Got my little girl's country club boats that she runs in her little pool. Got the Geico for my rescue. And I got to say, that's a fun little boat, man. It screams for being so small. And then this one here is actually one of the uh, WL Toys. Um, I think it's the 109. I'm not positive. But again, wasn't a big fan of the way it looked factory. So got some waterproof vinyl on it. Thought it turned out pretty good. I like bright boats. Something I can see. I'm getting old. Um, but anyway, guys, that's the that's the quick rundown. Just wanted to add a little content. Still trying to figure this out, so bear with me. RC Hub City out. If you're watching, appreciate it. And we'll talk to you guys on the flip side.